Hello, this is my Khan. In this short video, I'm going to be showing you the composite application to the bridges. Why composite? Because composites are nine times stronger than the steel, and the life of the composites are over a uh, lot longer than the steel due to the corrosion properties of the steel. Uh, here are the some of the composite uh, bridges uh, layout and then you can overlay the concrete on the top of it has a free body of this bridge how you can make those uh, composite parts because the composite part doesn't has to be that deep uh, since uh, since they are stronger not stronger some of the composite um, after uh, they got um, bonded uh, to the structure here the some some of the manufacturing processes uh, how you can start doing your planning your cantilever or beam beams here's uh, the free body diagram again uh, these are the free body diagram we propose uh, by taking some of those uh, the grandfather bridge designs into the composite bridges these are the bounding um, process. Um, again, this free body diagram. Some of those uh, um, the the bounded composite uh, shown in these figures. Again, those bounded uh, composites are shown in the, the figures. Uh, joints, uh, tension and trans transfer members. joints well joints um, also of course there are some welded parts that needs to be attached to the bridges so we have to show you those uh, how you can uh, uh, introduce your welded part into the bridges here's uh, some of the free body diagrams and uh, uh, next next slide show you the shear moment diagram Next slide. Uh, some of those uh, the classic uh, I beam type composite structures, uh, they can be uh, brought to brought to the job site and then can be bounded very quickly. Again, examples uh, for how the overlay of the concrete over the composites. Some of the joints, um, the tension fittings. Uh, for the pathway or side of the, the highway. This is another um, FEM model we have done. Uh, these are the long highways. Um, uh, let me show you in the next picture. So the here's the free body diagram. So these are composite parts, and they're very light, and then can be brought to the site, and then you can overlay those concrete in days. Uh, the inside structure, how the tension members, uh, how you can overlay your concrete with the composites. Uh, also, the composite bowstring uh, arches with concrete decks are often used uh, uh, where the construction depth is limited. Example for the bridges, canal, rivers. Uh, these are uh, can be done very quickly um, because of uh, the the properties of the composite and the, the toughness of the material. Another example: um, the existing bridges can be uh, re redesigned if they are falling or or needs to be repaired, so the new bridges uh, structure can overtake some of the bridges. Very. Um, successfully here's the free body diagram uh, another example of the, the tension bridges uh, how, how the composite uh, layout or or bonding process how the how is going to be look after the bonding 
here's the example of the the bridges over the water and these are these are all composite parts and where they're very uh, can be done very quickly and easily and brought out to the to the site and uh, can be assembled very long long bridge uh, for the major highways few other examples with free body diagram another uh, free body diagram so showing the free body diagram and the pictures how it's going to be looking and then how you can calculate your loads another example so these bridges have been done in US or Germany uh, very successfully uh, free body diagram again uh, here's the 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 use of parallel uh, stand cables these are galvanized wax and PE coated polyethylene coated um, strands instead of traditionally the use of fully locked coil ropes uh, here's a free body diagram of this bridge and then uh, showing the bottom part how the composites and concrete are uh, bonded together here's a cross section for that same bridge and look at that here how thin uh, and how strong is the bridge and then uh, versus the steel bridge and the next next slide we can show you that uh, the bigger longer part how you can manufacture steel and composite parts thank you